Zelfie dans le bouche à bouche, in this video we are realizing a puff pastry. Yummy! We need 150 mm of water, 200 grams of butter, but you need to remove it from the fridge about one hour before because you want it to be soft and some extra flour. Well, it's super easy to realize. You will put on your work plan your plain flour, you shape in there a hollow, you pour in your hollow the water, with your finger you will incorporate the flour to the water slowly, and when it starts to leak, you will just put the flour in the middle with the water and you will start to knead until you can shape a ribbon. As you can see, it's pretty sticky. Once you obtain a bowl, you add some flour on your work plan. You avoid it to stick. You put your pasta on it. You shape four sides look like that and you will shape branch with the rolling pin don't be shy with the floor you don't want it to stick you turn it over you press it with your palm and you do it again you will applique in the middle your butter you will fold the branch on top of the butter Then you tap your past, both sides, you fold it like that, hop, hop, and you will start to roll it out. You will do it six times, both sides. your pastry if you want the best effect you leave it to the fridge one hour before you use it if you want to use it for a pie you preheat the oven at 180 degrees you will roll out your past to obtain a circle you drop it on your pie dish your puff pastry will blow up and uh, it won't give you in the end the shape of your dish so what you need to do is a sausage with some foil and you need to put it all around your pie to have a resort effect and like that it will stay as you want it look like that and you will put it in the oven for 25 minutes at 180 degrees with the past left you can do a lot of other things but or you can just freeze it to use it another day if you want it to be a bit golden, you just uh, beat an egg into an omelette and you paint your past just before you put it in the oven. Add on top cream or fruit or anything. You have a great tart to it. I'll see you later for a new recipe on Bouche à Bouche. Bye bye.